celebrating their 100th season, the Boston University men's basketball team opened its season hosting George Washington University at Aganis Arena on November 14th. GW streaked to an early 9-0 lead, but the Terriers fought back and tied the game at 21 with four minutes left behind 10 points from Carlos Strong off the bench. Bang! First three of the night for the Terriers, and this is a two-point game. John Holland had 11 in the first half to put the Terriers up at the half. Picked up by Holland in the backboard, the two-hand jam! And they're on their feet here at Aganis Arena. During halftime, the athletic department celebrated the 50th anniversary of the 1958-1959 Terrier team, which advanced to the Elite Eight of an NCAA tournament, the team's first NCAA berth of all time. The number 10 jersey of senior co-captain Jack Lehman was retired during the ceremony. In the second half, the game went back and forth. The Terriers led by as many as seven before the Colonials held a two-point lead with just seconds remaining. Five seconds, four to shoot, three. The deep right side three by Wilmore, no good. Forey low, rips down the got rebound. Him. He's got five seconds. He goes the length of the four, lays it in with two seconds to go. Two seconds left, GW brings it in, and we are going overtime. The Terriers showed great poise in making their comeback to tie it and led by as many as five midway through overtime. But just couldn't put the Colonials away. Playing an Atlantic 10 team tough gives the Terriers confidence as they prepare for a trip to Bucknell on Tuesday.